June 25th, 2021 it is. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm about to discuss a really, really heavy issue. Uh, the kind of issue psychiatric hospital of Ljubljana, Polje, Moscow, Belgrade, therefore Ljubljana anticipated it would classify me back into a category they have uh, designated me into. Uh, that's basically into a category of the mentally ill, um, schizophrenic, lunatic, paranoid, uh, that kind of stuff. So, uh, they could torture and they did, not for one day, torture to unconscious. Not three days, not one week, not month, not year. Uh, this people murdered since 2012 to very today. I got mountains of psychiatric letters, threats, and uh, when it comes to pain, I have experience in uh, so-called therapy is actually impossible to explain. At one point in time, I pulled out of my danka in Slovenian language, um, out of my system with my hands, literally. Um, excrements so that I wouldn't go you know that they wouldn't open me a stomach and cut me through to get them out because I couldn't use the toilet for several days this is the way it was another time I wanted to be returned back uh, to psychiatric hospital because of the physical pain I have experienced of course the pain was so severe that I had oil. They told me that's not possible. Literally oil dripping of my out of my skull. Uh, it was such a pain that I didn't want to be inside of the house. I wanted to go to the forest and so on. Uh, they would keep me inside. They would they would tie me up and uh, keep me inside of the lock department for six months at a time like quite unimaginable right and um, I'm not today here that I would cry to you about this stuff but I want to touch on the more important issues for me unfortunately this issue is concerned other issues too uh, issues that go beyond Ljubljana beyond Belgrade, beyond Moscow, uh, something Milan Kuchan, something Borut Pahor, something Slovenian politicians like uh, like um, Loise Peterle, uh, Slovenian politicians like Janis Janša did manage to accomplish. They, they managed to accomplish, maybe, maybe, maybe they hated me so much. In the US, I have no idea, maybe they hated me Elsewhere, I don't know what the deal was. I don't really care about it. Uh, they did manage to to put filth on the hands of the politicians from elsewhere too. They filth on on <laughs> on a countries from abroad. Literally, they did manage. They did accomplish that. Sometimes in. 2015, pretty sure I am. It was a whole delegation that went to United States of America. Uh, Peter Le, Louise Peter Le was the one who claimed to have uh, cancer issues and I don't know what. So they took him to the US and once they took him to the US, it was even Milan Kuchan that would go to United States of America. Guess who the number one sponsor of this trip to the US was. Uh, the w number one man of this trip, the sponsor of this thing, was Joe Biden. Joe Biden, for those that know him in the US, he is an expert on the cancer issues. He's got a strong connections throughout the American medical system. 
And quite frankly, from what I can recall, a great friend of Donald Trump, uh, Joe Biden has a, the most advanced knowledge when it comes to cancer and really strong connections throughout the U.S. Look, so many times I came across Joe Biden, especially in the U.S., whenever I was next to Donald Trump, that I know these elections are bullshit beyond funny elections. We live like in a, in a lemon world, and a little bit I'm going to get to this issue here. The lemon just got drier and there is more more than it, so on. We live in totally, totally fake world. The one that should, it was his turn to, for presidential candidacy, that was Dwayne Johnson, The Rock. And it's also the one I have supported to become a president. But because American diplomacy, because American politics is so filthy, it would be not good. It wouldn't be good because he's going to come out one day, you're going to go and you're going to vote for him uh, like a positive, like a normal person, clean individual, not like Joe Biden. And Joe Biden just got that filthy assignment and it's basically to get rid of me. American citizen who ended literally inside of even Guantanamo camp to be tortured, not only all over Eastern Europe and on a surgical table in Belgrade in 1996, which I think the whole science really was to, I think, stab lint nodes, cause injuries to them. Now, I don't think there was more to it. I think that the whole science that Russia had was concentrated on that kind of issue. I don't think there was more than that. All right. Um, the problem here I am experiencing, and I do want to talk about, and that's why it's a paranoid, schizophrenic video, psychiatric hospital, Ljubljana Polje. Uh, unfortunately, also people in England, people in United States of America, some people have anticipated would find its way uh, to life for today, uh, is that I think that I might not even have a real cancer. Uh, I actually believe that, and I do so more and more, that this whole thing is a fake stuff I think because in 2015 uh, and also in 2017 when they had me in United States of America that's what it was it was another human trafficking to the US literally again to Walter Reed medical system they would always have me in this fucking Walter Reed medical system in Delaware, uh, that's Joe Biden, and also in Washington State, Walter Reed. I think that they have implanted me with something and that whatever that is, I think super, super closely reminiscent uh, cancer related symptoms. That's exactly what the fuck I think. I think this is remotely Bluetooth operated, I don't know, maybe a radio controller issue. Uh, and I do have a, quite a few reasons behind one. Now, all through Sebastian Kurz, this is an Austrian politician, insisted that I'm going to have a cancer, and this is how they started with this bullshit. Uh, one category of people insisted that I'm going to have a cancer. Uh, his approach to this issue was that um, there were people in the system 
that obviously they play with a cancer giving them a cancer because he wouldn't be fucking talking about it, stuff like that that believed that the cancer was not real that there were people there were people like this that was Sebastian Kurz literally inside of this home this is a tortured cell cell here you have no fucking idea what kind of butcheries went inside in here this torture cell far beyond exceeded far beyond the torture cells I was compelled to during my stay in Poland this is this bunker here this place here this place hosted politicians royalties all kinds of garbage you possibly can imagine during which stay here wherever they have spoken and they made an agreement and so on it was a severe torture also that would take place he said uh, in a sense is what exactly uh, that there was people that uh, even had this kind of ideas that they're gonna get abducted and so on and so forth well uh, let me explain something to you the reason for this video is because one American told me he told me like this he said to me one time you're gonna overeat the stuff and you're gonna go and you're gonna try to lose the calories and so on and this and that um, and if you're gonna do I don't know what kind of exercise and burn I don't know how many calories and stuff like this it's gonna be the last time we're gonna stop stop what stop the shit that started in 2018 upon my return in Belarus from Belarus uh, that's basically the sound like that would just um, take me over basically night and day 24 7 systematically and really just like I was told by my knees that this is what I'm gonna look that's what they put the photo to me over there inside of the kitchen um, Germans of course they're always guilty for everything this here is a massive hard drive failure it says right there you can see the guy working in the computer however he is about to fell down pretty much exactly how I fell uh, this is my niece's business I have explained that this she invested a vast amount of effort to literally get me murdered a lot of this paranoia shit was done through her her husband Mitya Weber incited in a suicide insisting me that I have inside of me I don't know what kind of implants and the only way for me to get rid of those implants is by basically throwing myself across the bridge so that it's gonna blow my head apart uh, and that's how the whole thing is gonna stop it's like this yeah this thing here this thing remains over there this lemon still downstairs on a uh, on a radiator on a, on a heater I bought one for this video special right now it's like this a cancer when I did that exercise that day when I constant a little extra because I was doing on this German video and just like they promised me they would just keep block me stop me fuck me from recording the video and I did so it was very disappointing frustrating so I used food to suppress this frustration and with as little as possible mental cluster mental flaws uh, issues moved forward because this is why this is how I stay mentally healthy uh, however during the process and it, that was amazing it was just as this American have stated um, the sound stopped this pressure that feels at times like it's gonna blow my head it stopped fucking stopped I was told all kinds of shit that it stopped 
as Americans said, and from this is going to be your last time, and from there on it's just going to go on, we're going to intensify and so on. What do you think about this? It actually really did happen. Ever since the song, the pressure goes on. From the theories in which even a local here, Dr. Kotar was involved, gesture me how I'm going to go into a seizure during the night sleep and be hijacked and so on and so forth. This was like a mass conspiracy shit they had given me into a little bit different kind of conspiracy and this conspiracy for which some have claimed is going to have to do with the Poland because Poland, look, did this thing here. This is what Poland did. Malnutrition almost epidemic among patients with advanced cancer. Uh, Poland was like uh, $17 per month inside of this asylum system where I persisted uh, for, I don't know, a year and a half and which those 17 bucks I would have to spend half on repairs because that's where they would destroy me everything. Uh, from this kind of uh, stuff, if Poland did this, because Poland claimed also that I don't have no cancer, no brain cancer, no cancer, no nothing, I went on several examinations and so on, everything with me they claimed all along was perfect okay. I don't know how the fuck perfect okay, because that already amounted like for over like two years of me having this kind of problem that I had a real difficulty to manage but that everything was okay and so all those researches they have done uh, with zero anything that would demonstrate that they have some kind of problem uh, to this kind of issues it actually really 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 makes me wonder about what the fuck here goes on you know ladies and gentlemen I used to be obese I used to be obese I know uh, but at large I have lost that weight I, I probably most definitely you would say I do classify for like epic body you know you know you would say this is this is what the athlete body looks like, right? Uh, the thing about it is that it doesn't make any difference. It makes no fucking difference. The pain I had in arm here, the lymph node, um, it's gone. I got rid of it literally through a massive exercise. The pain I, g I had here at this place here, right next to spleen also a lymph node it's gone that stuff it's all gone it's it's gone so what the fuck is going on why is it that this sound this shit go just as strong or maybe even stronger than before uh let me explain something when i experienced this sound this shit when it all started I didn't have any kind of pain, not here, not there. My lymph nodes, I wouldn't figure out there would be anything wrong with them. Because it was not. It felt like perfectly okay. I didn't see anything that would be wrong with me. So, crazy, paranoid, motherfucker, schizophrenic as I am. This is what my ex-roommate from Washington State, who also was involved in MK Ultra from Bellingham. Rachel Steiger, hello, hi. Um, I have no explanation, I have no logic, anything whatsoever that would somehow rationalize this kind of stuff. But what I can offer with is this shit here, for which I was told in advance the case is going to be. And if you look at 
a Yahoo, you have to admit me. Now, Yahoo started this shit that you see with this thing here, with um, with this. This was like the news. It appeared on a Yahoo uh, with uh, Biden. Uh, let's Biden. Let's cure cancer. Yeah, that's basically what it was on the on the Yahoo News, uh, and now these days there's nothing other than a fucking cancer. This guy, this guy is with a cancer. Uh, Mark Hoppus says uh, undergoing uh, chemotherapy for cancer. It sucks. I am scared. Um, then you have. And then you have that kind of stuff that uh, somewhat reminds of uh, hijacking and stuff like that from Britney Spears. Um, I don't want to go crazy, but Britney Spears' father who was involved in this, Britney Spears who was involved in this, gestured that she's going to do some news like this to remind me they're going to try to hijack me. For the conspiracy lovers, all you have to do is but basically go to the Vladimir Putin's site and you can see that one of the main shit they roll on is already Guru John McAfee uh, and yeah, high living paranoid he was and this and that who however did have this kind of stuff here going uh, if I suicide myself, I didn't. Supporters dredge up all the McAfee tweets to cry for over that as his Instagram page posts a queue. Uh, this is yet another stuff I was told the news is going to be released to remind me that they tried to hijack me. So, for me, at this point in time, at least I'm going to make the thing uh, so impossible to answer for this people from psychiatric hospital Ljubljana Pori on how to see this, but still promote my cause. Is a fact of fake death certificates at large that goes on in United States of America for what I was also told by Angela Merkel personally that there is so much racism going on in the US as a lot of people just try to evade all the problems they have domestically and she pointed in racial issues there are racial issues uh, I do deem that Black Lives Matters organization is a terrorist organization this is actually in my opinion, even anti-human rights agency. I think they support fake causes. Uh, lots of it, I think it's fake. Uh, their leaders have demonstrated money in turn for corruption. And guess what all these people, all these people all these people who have so many problems. All these people who have so many fucking problems, they're not opting out for a space missions from the US, but they are immigrating into Russia. And this is something I already have explained, I already have suggested is happening at large. This is what the fuck is happening, make no mistake about it. Now you see how this crazy conspiracy theory backfired straight into Russia. Now this theory is not so insane. Now this hijacking, abduction, bullshit has actually grounds.
ladies and gentlemen uh there is i am tired it's really like my knees left me this shit here this, this really feels like you would have hard drive you would go to fucking end you would be coming to an end um, but i really don't think it's cancer but when I say that I don't think it's cancer, I'm afraid they're gonna give me one. That's how crazy this shit is. You know why I actually think that they might give me one? It actually reminds me of this news here, look. It's a top news, look. Nearly all COVID deaths in the United States of America are from one group, they say. And you know what they say? This is the group that is unvaccinated. Okay. Uh, just because nearly all COVID deaths in the US are now from one group, that still, believe it or not, as crazy as my sound, does not prove the point. Because it could be a government that targets afterwards people that are unvaccinated to prove their theory is valid so um, to speak MK Ultra stuff sucks a German guy Stefan whom I have interviewed the other day with his friend and gave you a complete background on MK Ultra told me that they are gonna be actually having ability to even analyze elements in my body and based on my food choice whether what kind of food i'm going to be eating it's what the cancer is gonna progress in me i'm afraid that uh, a polish psychologist insisted me to take like little bites not much little even to drink little by little uh, this story changed all the time the thing is that with so much bullshit you got to admit it's hard to know what the fuck goes on with exception of few things I have demonstrated to you in this world are very very real maybe the biggest fact that's becoming more and more evident is that truly as Vladimir Putin dreamed about uh, East and for uh, Russia does not defer in this uh, inhumane methods anymore much from the West this is another news Yahoo rolls down you see it's all June 24 all about the cancer Monday June 21st uh, it started with a Biden the same week the same shit let's cure cancer on a Yahoo all through that was not Yahoo don't worry I am completely aware of that that's a screenshot from Washington Post that dates back to April 29 which is really not far back but I did not take the front page of the Yahoo so uh, this is a lunatic this is a Satan there ain't no fucking doubt about that but he's not the only one in a Hollywood if I do scroll down If I do scroll down on a Yahoo, this man here, among others, awaited me. I'm just uh, gonna this go this way, and I'm just gonna write down his name. Mick Jagger appears with. Uh, a photo which they well could use you know they well could use this photo to 
um, traumatized or whatever. That's very, very possible. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's see this photo. Yahoo people, founders, uh, everyone from Yahoo was involved in this stuff almost from day one of MK Ultra. This is a sickening photo, not this one, but this here. To me, under MK Ultra, this was the sickest shit. Sick as shit photo. Um, enough, enough to assume this is a sickening shit. Is to look at the faces here, and you can clearly see that they do. You have to re remind of mental ill people more than anything else. This isn't fucking normal. Well, this is what awaited me in a Hollywood. And I was very, very unpleasantly uh, surprised. I know, you're gonna say, young people, these people could be so violent that you have no fucking idea. Yeah, even better was the story from Mick Jagger that he needs me to get a cancer so he can solve his problem the story was indifferent from others here that you have seen on a Yahoo this guy was involved in MK Ultra. This was the story that would remind me, supposedly, that I do have cancer. This story here. This is the story. Oh, look at that. There you go. So, nicely they repeat this stuff here. Oh, uh, on a Yahoo. I am trying to get that other guy, not only this one. There was nobody more pathetic than James Michael Tyler, uh, who got cancer already very early. He got a cancer already back in, I think that he cried about already like in 2002, 2001, something like this. And blamed me for it. Therefore, he blamed very, very possibly this year of meaning if I can refer to malnutrition then it would be basically this country here that's a Polska Poland this country uh, basically the country that hijacked me also uh, stolen hard drives, uh, telephones, all that stuff, have stolen all that, 
when I file for protection in one and would even modify my Yahoo accounts to the degree that they would always explain here Poland um, you can go here you can type in here Berlin like this I yet need to learn how to get rid of that they modified everything but still the Poland is gonna be here displayed you can type in here Washington maybe United States of America Washington State but Poland is gonna stay number one no matter what how they did this shit I don't know uh, I yet have to discover but this was not the only thing they modified stolen stuff uh, I'm not gonna go into these issues um, I uh, I feel sorry I think this is really really pathetic that individual like this would go and blame me for something that um, what can I say I'm age 50 when I did go through Poland I was age 48 and he didn't go through any of this uh, he doesn't have a spine broken he doesn't have any kind of problems he had a life paved with a flower suddenly uh, money for nothing song from dire straits basically would fit him perfectly okay uh, but yeah I was guilty to him I was I was guilty to Mike Jagger um, a whole bunch of people like this that because of me through me basically is how eventually they would get a cure for the cancer that there is a cure for cancer and through me sure enough they're gonna get a cure for cancer uh, folks right here at the top it says about the Russian puppet asset um, just go enter yourself this here these two links and you're gonna learn why God hates him um, I don't have anything else to say I actually believe that I don't have a cancer I because not only because of that but because sometimes I eat crazy shit uh, I would completely disregard what my niece told me told me about how I'm not gonna eat the stuff that I like uh, funny because I'm 50 and I'm still without wife without the children without everything because of people like this because of gurus like this and yet there are people out there that envied me what I'm gonna eat um, I don't know what to say uh, a whole lot of hatred in this world hatred also for convenience but I still think because of the food I ate because I totally have broken that protocol of green green you will only eat vegetables vegetables uh, I would even eat and go sleep and stuff and drink coffee and my head was like like it's gonna explode uh, literally thinking that as I'm going to sleep I'm not gonna even fucking wake up anymore or something like that but holy shit uh, it didn't happen that way it it would go down um, I would be completely okay and I would go with the parents out I would take them to a doctor to a physician park the car and within minutes I would try to get some sleep inside of the car my head would fucking explode now all those scenarios about directed energy attacks pop up yeah the truth is the car is really does have issues there is a radiation in it but 
it, it, it goes it goes to a hundred it's indicating hundred when you go uh, when you measure with one it's very low this Volkswagen Polo and on the top it goes hundred and so on but I don't think this got anything to do with it I don't even think it's got to do anything with pharmaceutical company Kirka which not only got a hold of uh, this is just aspirin this is just aspirin pills pills medications for schizophrenia patients as I was told you're gonna be labeled as a paranoid schizophrenic so we can get those pills so we can get the kind of stuff from the West and so on which they did it was from Kirka pharmaceutical people who told me under the ultra they're gonna come forward and testify that it's not even the last theory Kirka pharmaceutical I don't think it is came up with and I did video recorded but I don't have it here ha handy here um, they made a publication of their internal uh, magazine about hypertension and about a new medication for which they told me also would get from the West so I could get that and cure myself uh, and if I would not want that because of the stuff they have done to me <laughs> I would just have to buy that from the West when I said this <laughs> you all you have no idea what kind of fuck this is MKUltra what kind of a psychotic people in there what kind of shit instead of brain these people have it's talking about torture because people behave like really really evil crazy insane maybe something I even take pride in maybe something I even take pride in it because there is no there is no such thing as a remorse there is no such thing as a regret there is no such thing as an apology from this end it's whatever whoever misfortune suffered in this case no regret no remorse no nothing there only is a regret for the people that they did have misfortune I do regret that people did have misfortune I do regret that politicians did this shit not only to me but also to people all right thanks or I should say maybe even to you people thanks for watching this video today is June the 25th 2001 um, McAfee antivirus genius guru uh, said if I commit a suicide I didn't I don't think I do not believe this is a cancer I think I'm a little bit closer to that German bullshit uh, that touches the issue of even as I was told that they're gonna be watching me how I'm gonna fade away fade away and die like a cancer patient uh, but will actually not die from cancer I think it's got more to do with it they even came up what the fuck they even came up with what they claimed was a pill that you would consume and that you would be like dead for the period of up to like 24 hours 20 over 24 hours you would be like completely completely dead without any kind of signs uh, anything like this more than 36 hours uh, more than 24 uh, hours more than day day and a half 36 hours you could go without any kind of 
almost vital signs anything that people that would come coroner that you would see your mom dead you would 100% uh, be certain that is dead that was the theory for my father one of the theories too whether that kind of stuff exists or not I have no fucking idea they claimed it does thanks for watching this video and yeah, I'm talking about not regular people this case is a proven MK Ultra case not a bullshit I'm talking about elites top people that were involved in this case till next time yeah today is June the 25th 2021 um, this does not feel like a cancer this feels like something else and if this was a cancer why in Poland wouldn't they state me after going through all those health examinations with the stuff I had going why wouldn't they tell me about it doesn't make sense but sure enough they can give me one they can give me a hypertension they can give me whatever the fuck they want there's no doubt about that thanks for watching this video no really is shitty it really is like this I will not go under any kind of cancer treatment not even the tooth I have here uh, it's completely decimated now I'm not gonna go to the dentist until this case crime about this case officially gets admitted and if I do get abducted hijacked I'm gonna make a fucking suicide make no mistake about it that's gonna be a real one there will be no fucking reason uh, to doubt about that one. That's going to be a 100% deal.